Hello. 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 Hi, Jimin. This is Teacher Anna. Welcome to Listen and Speak. How are you? I'm happy. That's amazing to hear. Are you ready for our English class? Yes. Okay. So let me share your book because we will read a very nice story for tonight. So let's see. This is your book, Jimin. And before we go here, let's review the words that we learned last time. So last time, we learned some words. Okay, so let's read this word. What is this, Jimin? Pebble. Pebble. How about this one? What is this? Search. Search. And this one? Oh. Oh, and this one? Accept. 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 Very good. And we still have two more here. What is this? Nest. This it's a nest. How about this one? Ma marriage. Marriage. You say marriage. Marriage. Okay, that is amazing. So we have this words and we're done learning this last time. And before we read the story, let's try to complete the sentences. Okay. Jimin, can you please read this? I need to decorate or search. Search my room Very because good. I lost. I lost. I lost. I lost. My my glass. My glasses. My glasses. Very good. Now, I want you to try this one here. How about for number two? Can you try the, number two? The birthday boy. Mm -hmm. I'll set pet. The... Present. 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 Okay, Present. very good. Accepted. That is a nice answer, Jenna. Now, we need to read the sentence one more time, okay? Okay, it's time to read your answers again, Jenna. Let's read number one and number two. Number one, please. I need to search my room because I lost my glasses. Good reading. How about number two? Uh, the birthday boy accepted the present. Very nice. You got it all correct. Congratulations for that. Now it's time to read our story about pebbles for love. And I want you to look here and help me read, okay? Okay, let's start, Jimin. Let's say pebbles for love. Pebbles for love. Very good. Just wait for a second. Okay. Okay, sorry for that, Jimin. Now, let's read the story Pebbles for Love. Let's say, okay, let's start with the first part here. Can you help me read? Jimin? 
Sometimes I show my love to my parents. Parents. Parent. Yes, parents, your mom and dad. Okay, your mom and dad, they are your parents. Again, sometimes I show my love. Sometimes I, sh I show my love to my parents. I give them. I give them hugs. Some penguin. Mm -hmm. Penguin. Penguins. Some Pe penguins. Some penguins. So show love too, but they don't give hugs. Again, to penguins. penguins give. give Pebbles. Pebbles. Very good. So let's stop there, Jimin. So here, let's talk about this part first. So we can see here that we, like teacher Anna and Jimin, sometimes Jimin hug, okay? Do you hug your mom and dad, Jimin? Yes. Yes. So that's how you show that you love your mom and your dad. You show love by hugging and kissing them, okay? But for penguins, they don't give hugs. What do they give? They give... They give what? Pebbles. They give pebbles to the one that they love. Like this one, look. Look at the penguin here in the picture. You can see that the penguin is... um. Picking some pebbles using its beak. Okay, so this pebbles, the penguin will give it to the penguin that he or she loves. Okay? That's how they show love. They give pebbles. So let's try this one. Boy penguins. Hello? Yes? It's time to read, Jimin. Boy penguins give a pe pebble to girl penguins. They search the whole beach for something perfect. For, for, perfect. perfect. Boys often fight for the blessed paper. Okay. They put... They put what? Demand? Yes. It's time to read. They put the they paper put, in... Okay. Put. One more time. They, they put, put the paper in front of a girl. Okay, so that's how they show their love for a girl penguin, okay? Boy penguins give a pebble to a girl penguin. Okay, so a boy penguin will pick a pebble, a very pretty pebble, and then the boy penguin will give it to the girl penguin penguin okay so that's how they show how much they love the girl let's say they ask jimin yes they ask they ask do you like eat Girl, girls can accept the, the pebbles, the pebble that means 
They like it. She will. She will. She will put put it in her nest. Then. Then the penguin will will stay. Stay together. Together, there who lives, who each, lives. who lives, each like a uh, Mary. Very good. So when the boy penguin gives the girl penguin a pebble, the boy will ask, "Do you like it?" And if the girl will get, okay, if the girl will accept the pebble, it means the girl penguin likes it. And then, the girl penguin, what will the girl penguin do? What will the girl penguin do, Jimin? Hello? What will the girl penguin do? She will put it in her nest. Very and, good. Uh, That's it. She will put her or she will put it in her nest, and then it means she really liked the pe the pebble. And the boy and the girl penguin will stay together like a marriage for like like the one that your mom and dad have. Okay. So let's have this one. Let's read the last sentence and then let's answer some questions about the story. Can you help me, Jimin? Uh, show someone, someone you love them, give them a pebble. Very good. That's amazing. Thank you very much. Now let's have this one, okay? Okay, so Jimin, we will answer questions about the story and I need your help, okay? Okay, let's start with number... Oh, the first one. What is the main idea of the story? What is it all about? Let's read letter A and letter B, okay? Okay, let's read letter A and letter B. And two... Penguins give pepper to show their love. Letter B. Uh, penguins can show their love in many ways. What's the answer? Is it A or B? What is the main idea of the story? A. A. Very good. That's the correct answer, Jimin. That's so nice. Now, let's go and answer the next set of questions down here. Can you help me answer number one? Let's I... complete this sentence. I... I... I hug my parents. I hug my parents. I have a I my hug. Friend. I hug my friends. I hug my parents to what? To tell the secret? To make them sleep? Or to show love. To show love. Very good. That's amazing. To show love. How about number two? Can you read number two, Jimin? Where do penguins... 
where the penguins look for the perfect pebbles. Okay, where do they look? In the nest? The beach? Or under the sea? Where can they see a pebble? In a... Mm, in a nest? No. So let's see. Let's go back to the story. Okay. Look. Let's read this one. Can you help me read this, Jimin? Jimin? I search the whole beach, beach for something for a pet. Uh -huh. So where do they look? Let's go back, okay? Oh, sorry. Oh, no. This one. Okay, so where do they look for the perfect pebble? A, in a nest, the beach, or under the sea? The beach. The beach. Very good. How do we say that in a sentence? Let's say, they look for the, or you can say, they look at the beach. They search at, at the beach. How about number three? Can you help me with number three, please? They search mm. at, at the beach. How about number three? Why do some penguins fight? Okay. Why do they fight? What's your answer? Why do they fight? Hello? Yes? What's your answer? To get the perfect What's to your answer? find the best name. Is it A, B, or C? C. To find the best nest? Let's see, okay? So why do they fight? Okay, so let's see here. Okay, they fight because... Can you read this, Jimin? Can you read this, boys? Can you help me read this one, please? Boys often fight for the best ever. Very good. So what is the answer? Why do they fight? Oh no. Why do they fight? To show a girl love, to get the perfect pebble, or to find the best nest? To get the perfect pebble. Very good. To get the perfect pebble. Okay, how about number four? Can you complete this sentence for number four? When girls, girl, girl, penguins put a pebble in their nest in mint. Okay, what does it mean if the girl put a pebble in the nest? It means they want to be together, they want to fight, or they do not like the pebble. Huh? 
Hello? Yes. They they do not they want to be together. Very good. If if the if the girl penguin put the pebble in their nest, it means they want to be together, like a marriage, a husband and wife. You did so nice here, Jimin. Now I just want you to read your answers once more, okay? Okay, so let's read number one. Can you read number one? I hug my parent to show love. Number two. They search at the beach. Okay. Why do some penguins fight? Uh, to get the perfect paper. Okay. Can you complete this sentence? Can you help when me? Gar, when gar penguins put a Ever in their nest, it means. It means what? It means. It, it means they want to be together. Okay, there you go. You got it all correct. Jimin, thank you very much. Now, let's try this one together, okay? So, let's see. What will the girl penguin do, okay? So, I'll give you some options, okay? Okay. Mm. Okay, so you have some options here, Jimin, and you should complete the sentence, okay? Okay, so let's read. Can you read this, Jimin? A car penguin, a set. Accept it. Accept. 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 The pebble. What will a girl penguin do after that? She will put the pebble in her neck. Nest. Good job. She will put the pebble in her nest. That's a wonderful work, Tim, and thank you very much. That's a cool job. Now let's try something here. I want you to look here, okay? We still have a lot of time left, and I want you to try this with teacher Anna. So what we need to do is to choose the correct word, okay? Okay, so let's read this, Jimin. Uh, again to, again to penguin give pebbles to show love. Very good. How about for detail number one? Boy penguins Boy penguins search the whole beach for the perfect pebble. Okay. How about detail number two? They put They put the paper in 
front of the boy or girl boy oh the girl okay because the boy the boy look for the pebbles and they give it to the girl penguins okay so what's the answer here they put One more time, Jimin. They put the pebble, pebble in front of the guard penguin. Very good. And lastly, what will the girl penguin do? The girl penguin... The girl penguin. The girl penguin put the pepper in her nest. Very good. That's nice. See, you got it all correct. Thank you, Jimin. So that's how it works. That's how um uh, they show love in the penguin world. Okay. Okay, so let's try this one. So I think we don't have much time to finish this. So we will do this one next meeting. But before we go, I want you to read your answer one more time, okay? Okay, so Jimin, can you help me with this one, please? Let's read it one more time. Oi. Oi, penguin. Oh. All of it, all. Ah. And two penguins give pebbles to show love. Uh, boy penguins search the whole beach for the perfect pebble. They put the pebble in front of the girl penguin. The girl penguins put. Put, put the pebble in her nest. Okay, so Jibin, remember this word is put. Can you say put? Put. Put. Very good. That is amazing. Good job, Jimin. So that's it for tonight. We are already done. So we will do this next meeting. And then I'll show you your new story and lesson. So we will talk about ooh, a rainy day. So this will be our next lesson next time, Jimin. And then we will also learn about hmm, water cycle. How water... How we make uh, how nature makes water. Okay, how can we get a lot of water? Where are they from? So we will continue with this one next meeting, okay? And then we will have a review test again. Thank you for tonight, Jimin. You did a wonderful job. I can see you're getting better with your reading, and I'm very happy with that. Let's improve more. On your reading comprehension and how you answer in sentences. Goodbye, Jimin. Have a great night. Goodbye. Bye.